What if there was a crypto tax tool that fully integrated with popular exchanges and wallets was simple to use and best of all, it was completely free. Let's be honest guys, filing taxes is never fun, right? But it's especially difficult when you have to deal with crypto investments. And if you're like most people, you probably don't even know where to start when it comes to filing your crypto taxes. Because between all the different exchanges and wallets that you might've used over the year, Trying to keep track of everything and track everything down, well, it can feel almost impossible, right? But while crypto taxes can be a pain, your choice of tools doesn't have to be. Crypto.com's tax tool feature makes it simple for anyone to file their crypto taxes. Now, Crypto.com tax is a completely free tool that can easily import all your transactions from both the Crypto.com app as well as from other popular exchanges and mobile wallets, and then it can automatically categorize and calculate all your capital gains, all your capital losses. Not only is the tool free to use, but it's available to users in the US, Canada, the UK, Germany, and Australia. Australia. Now for full disclaimer guys, I am not a tax professional, nor am I providing you legal or tax advice. I just want to give you an overview of what the Crypto.com tax tool has to offer its users. Crypto.com tax is a tool that's meant to be used with a tax professional. So if you need tax advice, of course, always consult your CPA or your tax advisor. I'd also like to thank Crypto.com for sponsoring today's video and allowing me to share their Crypto.com tax tool with you guys. So I want to first start off by talking about the tax implications of selling cryptocurrency, because when it comes to crypto taxes, anytime you convert or sell a cryptocurrency, it's considered a taxable event. Now, profits can increase your tax bill while losses, they can offset those tax gains and help lower your overall taxes due. Now, there are generally two types of tax categories that cryptocurrency activity can be classified as. Firstly, you have realized capital gains. And realized capital gains are the gains you make from the crypto that you own. These gains can then be realized by selling your crypto. For instance, if you bought a coin at $5 and then you later sold it at $10, well, you have $5 in realized capital gains. The second category is called earned income. And this is the income you earn from activities such as crypto mining, crypto staking, earning interest, or even earning other crypto rewards. Again, all of this is treated as taxable income. Now, the amount of tax you owe is dependent on many factors, including the length of time you own the asset for, your total earnings throughout the year, and of course, your capital gains tax bracket. For instance, if you sold any crypto during the previous year and you made a profit, well, you experienced a capital gain. Now, capital gains, these can be categorized into two types. You have long-term capital gains and you have short-term capital gains. But what if you experienced any losses from a bad crypto trade or investment during the year? Well, these are called capital losses, and these can actually be used as tax deductions to help offset your capital gains. Now, when it comes to your tax liability, using long-term capital gains and capital losses to your advantage can make a significant difference in your overall tax savings. If you'd like to learn more about how you can use long-term capital gains and capital losses in your favor, be sure to stay tuned until the end of this video. But back to your crypto taxes. While calculating all your gains and all your losses on your own manually is certainly possible, it could be challenging, especially if you use multiple exchanges or crypto wallets beyond just a single one. Now, using a crypto tax tool can certainly make help filing your crypto taxes a lot more manageable. And this is where Crypto.com Tax comes into play because Crypto.com Tax is a tool that makes it easy for both crypto enthusiasts and investors alike, whether it's quickly gathering all your cross-platform transactions all the way up to generating organized tax summaries. With the tool, users can import crypto transaction records from supported exchanges and crypto wallets by either uploading a CSV file or by using the API synchronization with major platforms such as the Crypto.com app and several other major exchanges. Now, Crypto.com Tax then provides you with an estimation of your taxable gains and your losses on all relevant crypto transactions, which again, you can then use for tax filing in the summary format that best suits you. And this includes IRS form formats, as well as for tax filing software. So let's now hop on over to the crypto.com tax website so we can take a look under the hood and see how it works. So here we are now on the crypto.com tax website. And as you can see, the tool is completely free to use at no cost. It does connect with multiple platforms, wallets, and exchanges, which we'll go over the specifics in just a second. But basically, you just wanna scroll down here, click on Get Started, or at the very top of the website, crypto.com tax, that's the website, simply click on Sign Up. So once you sign up and input your email and a password, you then just have to choose your country of nationality. As you can see, it is compatible with, with a long list of countries here. Once you choose your country, then you just have to declare these terms of service, as well as understand and agree that this service does not constitute professional tax advice and you'll use it at your own risk. So just check those boxes, then click to verify, then simply click on register. And just like that, 
you have signed up with crypto.com tax. So let's go ahead and sign on in. All right, so after you sign up, crypto.com tax is gonna send you a two-factor authentication code to your email, which you just have to input that code on their website, as well as verify your email. After that, you're then gonna be proceeding to sign up and create an account. You just have to choose your default time zone and then choose your tax jurisdiction. And then you're gonna choose your tax year. Again, you can go back to the previous tax year or this tax year. Choose your base currency, you know, that's my base currency. And then you also have the option to choose your cost basis method, which is pretty cool. You can choose first in, first out, last in, first out, or highest in, first out. So choose your cost basis you wanna use for filing your taxes. I'm gonna do uh, first in, first out for my purposes, but always choose the one you wanna use for your purposes. Then you simply click on agreeing to the United States of America tax disclaimer. All right, click on save here. And just like that, we are now inside the crypto.com tax tool. As you can see here, it does have a quick start guide to add your wallets and exchanges, to review transactions, and to generate your tax reports. As also, you can also see your short-term and long-term net capital gains as well beneath that. You could see your income and transactions. This all shows zero right now because I haven't linked any accounts or exchanges yet to my crypto.com tax. Obviously, I'm gonna have to blur out my information for you without showing you guys, but to proceed, all you guys have to do is simply click on add right here to add wallets and exchanges. You can then select the wallet and exchanges from this drop down list. They currently offer uh, Bitcoin and Ethereum blockchains. It, as far as wallet goes, it looks like they're compatible with crypto.com app, also the blockchain.com wallet, Coinomi, Exodus. And as far as exchanges goes, you have the ability to integrate and connect with the crypto.com exchange, big one, Binance, Binance US, all these right here, Bitfinex. Uh, Changely, Coinbase, you also have FTX, Gemini, Kraken. So definitely some major platforms on this list here you can connect with, as well as other, which I assume you can manually connect if you manually upload your information. But as far as direct API integrations goes, it's about 20, 20 exchanges and wallets you connect with, a lot of the major platforms as well. So let's do a quick example of connecting a wallet or exchange to the crypto.com tax tool because it's a pretty simple process. Simply click on add right here. And you're then going to select your wallet or exchange, uh, see if it's supported on this list. For this example, let's choose the crypto.com app, give it a nickname. Let's just say crypto.com. And then you have two options to import your data. You can choose a to upload a CSV file as here, as you can see. Uh, you can upload from a generic template or from another CSV, or you can upload it from your computer. It has instructions here on the right-hand side to walk you through. Or you can also create an empty wallet exchange and import your data later. For now, let's do this option. Let's click add right here. All right, so as you can see, it has my crypto.com app there in the list. I haven't up later uploaded my CSV file yet, but I will get to that later. We go back to overview. So that's how you can add your wallets and exchanges. You can then click here to review your transactions after you've connected all your wallets and exchanges to the tool. Again, I don't have anything connected here yet because I don't want to show my information on online here, but this is where you can come to review your information. Then from there, so after you've connected all your wallets and exchanges to the crypto.com tax tool, and then after you've reviewed the information, you can then generate a report or multiple reports on this final step right here. Now, once you're inside the tax report section, there are a couple of different categories of tax summaries you can generate from the tool. The first is the capital gains and loss summary. Now the capital gains and loss summary, this includes things such as proceeds, your cost basis, selling expense, and of course, capital gains and losses. Next up, we have the transaction history summary, and this is a detailed listing of transactions that you can keep for your books and records. Thirdly, you have the income report summary, and this contains details of all the cryptocurrency that you received, and it shows whether the income received is taxable or not. Next, we have the gifts, donations, and payments summary, and this basically provides details of all the cryptocurrency that you sent. There are also IRS forms up here, US specific IRS form formats, including form 8949 and schedule D. Of course, guys, remember that any formats generated by this tool should always be verified by a professional tax advisor prior to you filing your tax returns. In addition to these IRS forms and other reports you can generate from the tool, crypto.com tax also directly integrates with tax filing software such as TurboTax right here. If you're doing a TurboTax online file, you can generate a CSV file from the report from the tool right here, download that file, File. then in your TurboTax account, you can upload that directly so it imports all your transactions that the report generated here straight into your TurboTax software. Again, before you generate a new report, always verify that your tax settings are accurate on the right-hand side, including
including the tax year, as well as your cost basis method. You can always edit that if you need be. And again, you can generate multiple forms here each time, simply clicking on generate and it will download a file to your computer. Now, separate from those summaries generated by the crypto.com tax tool, if you happen to be a crypto.com user and you earn more than $600 in income from crypto.com, such as from earning referral rewards or from earning interest through staking, you may also receive a 1099 miscellaneous form. And if you were eligible to receive a 1099 miscellaneous form, you should receive an email from crypto.com when the form is ready to download. This would typically occur by January 31st of each year. But even if you earn less than $600 in crypto income, you may still need to report the earnings on your tax return. Again, guys, you should always consult with a professional tax advisor on how to report their earnings before you file your tax return. And like I said, crypto.com tax is currently available in the US, Canada, Australia, Germany, and the UK. So for my international friends, there's a lot of access there. Now, if you'd like to open up a crypto.com account and utilize their crypto tax tool, you can get a $25 sign up bonus when joining through my referral link down below in the video description. When you join using my code every day, you'll get $25 in free crow deposited into your account when you sign up. When it comes down to it, crypto taxes, they can be complex, but using automation tools and tax saving strategies can make them a lot more manageable. Now, if you'd like to learn more about how to pay your crypto taxes, as well as how to use capital losses to help offset your capital gains, be sure to watch this video right here where I walk through a lot more in depth on all the essentials you need to know about paying your taxes on both your crypto and your NFTs. So click on over and I'll see you in that video.